Zen fam, so you may have seen over the last couple of years or so, there's been a lot of these wee posts on social media where it's like, uh, where are my gamers at that are over 30? Where are my gamers at that are over 40? And so on and so forth. Intimating that there's a time limit on when one is allowed to be a gamer. Now, I covered this better part of two years ago in my Gamers How Hardcore Are You video where I spoke about how many of us out here in the land of gaming are no longer a spring chicken. <laughs> I mean, check all the white in the beard. But here's the thing. As much as it is a case that like being a gamer that's, shall we say, approaching and certainly deep within midlife is acceptable and normal it does leave one to one other question and it's a question that not many people here on the platform are talking about especially those of us who operate on this platform in the field of gaming and uh, I'd like to get the response of a few of my YouTube friends on this one if indeed you're watching and I know a good chunk of you is that are we told to be talking about video games? <laughs> I mean, obviously, I'm going to say no. I mean, I'm pushing 50 here, and I love talking about video games because I love video games. That's why I started this channel. That's why I got involved in gaming culture as a subject genre for this year channel. But some people be like, oh, how can you talk about games? when you barely get to play them. How can you talk about games when you have to spend your money on rent and food and council tax and electricity and household gas and you have to you know, spend your money on traveling to or from work and buying food and look, just because I'm a quote unquote adult doesn't mean I don't enjoy video games. Equally, it means I that doesn't dispar me from talking about video games and to a point where I still love them enough to want to step in front of a camera and talk to you lovely people. If that was the case, what's the age limit on anything? Is there an age limit on crafting? Is there an age limit on football? If you can no longer really technically play football because your age would despair you from running around a field for 90 minutes kicking a ball, can you really still love football? Can you really still talk about football? Could you really still have a gaming, a, a, cha a YouTube channel based in football? And you can say that for so many other things. Just because I don't get to game as much as I did when I was in my 20s, when I was single, doesn't mean I don't love gaming as much as I did then. In fact, it's probably fair to say that I love gaming more now, because now it's... um a rarer thing for me to get to enjoy. I savour gaming more because when you're a married man with a family and a full-time job, the, the job itself eats eight hours of your day and you travel an hour 40 to your job and an hour 40 back from your job, then when you get back you've got responsibilities to fill one to got home and in the mornings when I get up I have to get my son off to school yeah the gaming time I do get is all the sweeter but because it's all the shorter I have to prioritize certain things I can't play the up to the minute games right when they come out because one I don't have the money and two, 
I don't have the time to be ever present in the most up to the minute game as they come out. I'm still, I mean, you see here behind me here, days gone. I only got done playing this a couple of months ago. It had been sitting in my backlog for I don't care to tell you how long. And my backlog is crazy. And any other gamer my age has a crazy backlog. Because we have responsibilities, because we have stuff we have to do. Now, when I was a young, free, single dude, I didn't have any money. I could game and train as much as I want. I mean, I used to study martial arts. I, this used to be a six pack. I mean, I'm not like a fat bloke or anything, but I'm not in half the shape I was in my twenties. I mean, I used to pump this and it used to raise and there was definition. I mean, it's still strong, but it's not what it was. Nothing is ever what it was. Everything is about change. Gaming is continually about change. Art imitates life, apparently. <laughs> so, just because I'm a bloke that's pushing 50, doesn't mean in my book that I no longer get to talk about video games. You yourself might have a different opinion. You might be like, yeah, but do you? <laughs> And you could debate that, obviously, in the comment section down below. But this is just Zen Bloke's thoughts. I think that it's perfectly crumulent for me to one, still play video games, still love video games, and still step in front of this camera to hopefully entertain and enlighten you good people in the Zen fam and anybody else that stumbles along to become Zen fam upon my thoughts within the gaming sphere. And with that, hashtag support Scottish YouTubers and of course as always, I ne bother.